Hello guys and welcome to our channel, this is Beaver Rule. In today's video I want to talk about a gem store or a trading post item because it's on sale so I found it's appropriate time to talk about and if you're coming to this video late, uh, it's not on sale on anything, still make the decision yourself if you want to buy it or not. I for me, I bought it before sale, the moment this uh, item was introduced to the game I immediately bought it and I think it's a must have item for at least the quality of life, especially for new players. But you can decide for yourself uh, if you're gonna use it or need it or not. So the item we are talking about today is this thing, recharging teleport to friend. It allows you to do too many things between quality of life or at least um, saving you troubles. Let's say you wanna open a map that you don't have or if you already um, uh, make an, an alternate character that you don't wanna play through story and you want to open uh, the living world season maps or expansion maps you simply teleport on someone who already have them a friend or someone in a squad it can be used in a party or in a squad so it can help you bypass restriction simply by teleporting to a people who already bypass those restrictions it can also help you uh, teleport to a jumping puzzle box on someone already there so it offer a lot of value teleporting to friend is a very very good mechanic that everyone use in the game if possible however there is also this other item that uh, can be consumed to teleport to friend and that's the main reason why i say it's very good for new accounts we get it from birthday gifts we get it as um well not so much uh, an item from the black line chest keys um they are very expensive so but randomly you can get them from so it's not really that dependable and eventually they will end if you are using them constantly especially if you will be using them for quality of life like uh, teleporting on someone simply so you don't have to go out to a waypoint and then walk all the way to specific events they are in you simply teleport on them completely lazy mood which another value you can use it so we can use it either to bypass restriction teleport to jump and puzzle maps to open or we can use it also for quality of life to teleport to events and just save time in general now let's show how it work as you see my friend here is offline if i double click on it it will give me this window whether in a party or in a squad it will show every member but it will tell me i cannot teleport an offline player so this is the window that you will have you will have uh, every uh, party member here or squad member and the one you will choose you will teleport to its location now my friend is online and once i press accept Yes, I will be teleported to the location she's in right now. And that's the end of the jump and puzzle in Kining. And I get to loot a chest without doing the jump and puzzle or doing anything, which is very, very good thing that I can do. And you can do the same to unlock maps or anything. Like right now, I didn't play the story with um, this engineer, but I can simply go to uh, the rest of the map, just flying around with sky scale or using any mount and just unlock everything, which what I already did and even completed this map without playing the story, without doing anything, simply by teleporting to my friend using it. And that's why it can be a very good quality of life. The other downside to it, it will give you a cooldown of one hour that you cannot use it again and it is a character specific. So if I go to any other character, I will be able to use uh, the teleport to friend immediately. And that's why I have it inside here or um, shared inventory. So you, get, you buy it and you put it in your shared inventory. And now every character can use the same thing. You can use your alt so doing different things or anything. And you can simply uh, teleport them and each one of them will have a separate cooldown. This is the perfect way to use it. Remember, you double click on it. You choose a party member or a squad member, you press accept, teleport to them, they have to be online, you will get this cooldown and it is a character specific. Now for the lazy mood. And as you see here, if I change character and go to my ranger, I do not have the cooldown. And I can simply teleport to my friend again doing other things. And you can even use it from the looking for group, uh, you can be doing a meta or anything like Dragon 4 for example, and you join the meta event and then teleport on someone who doing it without going through the bother of uh, doing anything else or moving to the map or going to a point and then walking where the boss at the end of the map, no, you simply teleport to them. The same way I will do to my friend here, she's doing a bounty, I can teleport to her and the bounty completely comfortable without even changing maps, simply by clicking on it. So each day you play in BVB, you will probably be using it just as a quality of life and it will save you time. That's why I think it's a very, very good item that you should have. 
and as you see I teleported here right at the face of this bounty and now we get to do it together completely simply uh, no problem without me have to walk in or doing anything and look where we are we are very far from uh, any waypoint I would have to go and climb and do so many things so simply I will get to her bounty and sometimes it's even um, can save you the trouble of going again to an event like let's say a commander already can have bounty that you need for an achievement or something like that and if you walk all the way you will lose it because it will be already be dead you're coming late using teleport to friend will simply get you there as fast as possible so it's not just you being lazy sometimes it will spare you actually have to wait for the event to happen again it cannot be used in specific area like instances it cannot be used in dungeons for example or teleport inside a fractal something like that doesn't actually work obviously so keep that in mind but you can use it everywhere else so tell me what you think or if you're gonna buy it it's in uh, trading boost simply for um, 640 gem right now instead of 800 it's very useful in my opinion so give it a shot you won't regret it but always put it in the shared inventory that will be it for the video and i'll be seeing you next time peace